I am back with another video, and this time it's my Ollie's Christmas slash, um, bunch of stuff I bought. Um, Carol wanted to go out to Ollie's on Saturday, but she didn't think she could. So we were planning on going on Sunday, but then weather was bad, it rained off and on, storm, that kind of thing. So we went on Monday, we were talking about going on Black Friday to check out what Ollie's had. And Carol was like, I don't know if they're doing anything because I haven't seen anything, heard anything. So she said she would ask them, and she asked the guy that was working there, and he said they weren't doing anything special. And I noticed that when we were walking around, that a lot of the stuff that I saw looked like it was stuff that should be out for, like, Black Friday, kind of like what we bought last year. You know, like blankets and beauty products and games and things like that. And I'm like, these look like what they, they were kind of doing last year from Black Friday. Shouldn't they have that stuff out from Black Friday? And our haul, our Ollie's look like it was already being picked clean all the kids books were almost all gone all the faith religious books were all gone um all the stuff that i just mentioned that like we bought last year was almost all gone um quite a bit of stuff so they were already picking clean our ollies i find it very funny that they're talking about how people aren't really you know christmas shopping and are trying to you know save and junk and i'm going you know, I'm kind of wondering about that because I keep seeing it at the places I've been to. It seems like they are shopping a lot more than I think that they realize. But anyways, so this is the first thing I saw when, well, not the first thing I saw, but one of the things I picked up. This is the 2021 edition um, Disney Advent Calendar. It's a storybook collection. I remember seeing this. And I thought this was just so cute. It was $9.99. And so here's what it looks like on the inside. And as, like I said, it's storybooks. So they're wrapped up. And so I pulled this one out. It's 101 Dalmatian Snow Puppies. And so each day you, uh, you pull it out. Because apparently you don't have to unwrap them. And they give you a little cute little story to go with it for each day and I remember thinking how cute I thought that was so when I saw it I went ahead and grabbed it so this is going to be my advent calendar for next year I didn't even think about that when I grabbed it all of a sudden when I picked it up because I thought it was like a giant book until I, I realized it was an advent calendar so I decided to go ahead and get it then and just use it next year since I have that chocolate one and for $1.99, um, 28 holiday cards. Um, it looks like inspirational ones. They had $1.99, $2.99, $3.99, $4.99, like that kind of thing. Um, Kimberly Chapman of a Little Big Town, A Dolly for Christmas, The Two Story of a Family's Christmas Miracle, illustrated by Morgan Huff. It's all about their um, adopting a baby. Their daughter wanted to have a sibling. And so they finally got to adopt a baby. And her name is Dolly. Her name is apparently Daisy. And hers is Dolly. And then we got. Step into the Nutcracker. It opens like this. Let's see. Kind of opens like this, so I thought it was kind of neat. I love the Nutcracker. It's one of my favorite. Was one of my favorite ballets to go see with my mom. The Cat in the Hat knows a lot about that. A very crabby Christmas for three ninety nine. Oh yeah, the Nutcracker one was a dollar ninety nine. Yeah, it looks like a dollar ninety nine. And the other one, I can't remember if I said what the other one was. The Dolly one, she was three ninety nine. And then the Cat in the Hat Knows a Lot Christmas for $3.99. Yeah, I haven't had Christmas books in a long time, so I thought, why not? And so my mom would have loved it. Gingerbread Mouse for $2.99 for the little gingerbread. I thought this one was so cute when I saw it. And then on the inside, there's a little gingerbread mouse cookie recipe. I thought that was cute. so cute. And then I I finally picked up the Jessica Simpson open book for $4.99. I passed it up the first time I saw it, but then I decided to go ahead and get it because they 
Like I said, people are picking the place clean. And then the Hope We Hold, Ginger and Jeremy Blolo, Finding Peace in the Promise of God. This was another one I passed up before, but I went ahead and grabbed it. It's $4.99 as well. I figure go ahead and read them and, you know, that kind of thing. A Christmas Carol, Charles Dickens, $2.99. I thought that was, I like the cover of this one. And then, of course, my all-time favorite book outside of um, Anna Green Gables, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. Yeah, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. I apologize. Lewis Carroll, and Through the Looking Glass, and where she and what Alice found there. I didn't realize what that said there. I love the covers of these, and they're both two ninety nine. So pretty. But I really love those covers. Love over all Jesus Everyday Devotional Guide, Candace Cameron Bowie, two ninety nine. Yeah, I was shocked when I went in there and they had some more of these. One step closer devotional guide, Wild Hope, Candace Cameron Bray, two ninety nine. Um, kitchen towel in the Schultz. It just says uh, one pack kitchen towel. And these were, oh sorry, <laughs> these were two fifty nine according to this. So I got the initial ones. I would have gotten Carol one too, but they didn't have hers. So I don't know if she grabbed one or if she found one or not, but I was going to. And then these little candles, the battery operated candles. Um, or lights, yeah, candle light lamps. They were both 79 cents each. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them. So I'm going to put them in my mom's area or next to some pictures I have. So if I decide on it, I'll do a video showing everybody what I did with them. I picked up the L 2-in-1 White J Facial Roller. Facial Roller and Lifting Tool for $2.99. I kept seeing these things on everything, so I was like, ooh, oops. And then this thing, <coughs> Painless Hair Removal LED Light Vitatar, Simply Beautiful. $7.99. I thought, why not? I've seen the commercial for another one they have like that. And then a satin pillowcase and eye mask set. Oh, I thought that was kind of neat too. Looks like it's $5. Yep, $5. Yeah, you know, some of these just like they got some weird pricing that I can't believe that's the price. <laughs> and I think that I am done with part one of my video. So I will come back with part two. Thank you for watching. Bye.